Hello everyone, it's Boy Gunner Who here. I am so damn hot right now, you won't believe it. But anyways, welcome to the finale, aka episode 4 of Let's Play Super Mario Bros. 2. And that's so, we finished off worlds 3, 4, and 5, I think. I. But anyways, we're now down to the last two worlds, which are we finishing off the game. We're back in the scorching hot desert, which I shall feel like. like it is right now. <sighs> So yeah, more quicksand. Nope. And ow. Ow. Jump over that. Okay. So yeah. So, okay. Ow. Ow. Please let me through. Okay. Uh, oh great, they were spawned! Uh, make a safe state here. Okay, get rid of you guys. Another pansy, uh, great. Ooh. Then we can actually pick up that pokey. Um, hey, if you're my throat then. Hang on, it's the last episode, so I'd have to do any more coin. And here is some sort of sort of a where's the key type of area. Cause yeah, in one of these many faces there's a key here. The fact is, where is it? So basically, it's this is something you're gonna have a very annoying time to do with unless you have Nintendo power again. Don't know why they keep doing this, it's very stupid and annoying. I don't want to waste hours of my life just trying to find keys so I can move on to the next area. <sighs> so yeah, I'm wandering around, around any stage just trying to find for this key now. And I can't go down pipes one holding this rattlesnake here. So I need to let go of it. There we go. This one, okay, what about this one? So, it's one of these parts with, with a bunch of saying got dig for. And you know, you found the right one if there's a phantom mask right here. So, yeah, this is the part we need to look for. Okay, here's the key. Let me just get the heck out of here. No, you don't. Uh, pick up this key. Get away from me. Take it all the way to this locked door, and now we can move on to another boss. <laughs> Here you have a green birder, which again, oh, he shoots fireball, so he had to use the mushroom block to take care of her, it. There we go. Wasn't it bad, actually? Oh, thanks. No lights for you. Okay, only four more levels left to go. Yes, I said four. So, yes, I should now be choosing Princess Peach again. Move on to 6 2. Uh. And here I, could, I like to call the albatross fly now, guys. All you gotta do is just ride this albatross all the way to the other end of this level. Our first gospel here is this pansy here, which is basically you gotta tank a hit to this asshole, or basically you gotta do, do paper six super jump and avoid that pansy. So that's very annoying. And oh, come on. So yeah, basically it's. This level is basically a bunch of trial and error, knowing what's coming up. I jumped! Uh. Okay. And after that... Jump over there, and we should be coming up to the end of the level. Here we are. Okay. In here, oh, 
That's helpful. Yeah, what the boss? That was pretty quick. Another birdo which shoots only fireballs, so you know what to do at this point. Ow! Ugh. God, I hate the pollen. And I hate this boss fire power too. Okay. Okay, there you go. That's one hidden. Ugh. Come on. Just one more hit. There we go. Another birdo done and gone. Let's move on to the next boss. Okay, now it's time for well 6 3. Let's go Toad because we didn't see much action here. Him, so. Let's get out here again. And out to the squad just now. You can either do levels normal or take this huge shock which I'm taking right now. If you hug this wall to the, your left and NATO gets sinking in this quicksand, and then keep holding left but jump like crazy. You should be able to move right under this wall and reach the door here. Which literally. This is literally a huge shortcut which cuts out pretty the entirety of the level. So I'm sorry that I'm not showing this level in full, but. Ah, uh, well. I guess we're buying faithful and I can't really do a shortcut anyway. So I'm actually going to speed this up. Because this, because I'm lazy, don't say stays, but I guess Bird of Possible saying, just throw three eggs at it. Just throw three eggs at it, that should deal for her. And here's the will. Boss, the sixth boss. It's to return a Triclide. Now I don't know what the best strategy is. I hope people use like build a shield out of these mushroom block things and just throw mushroom blocks at it. But I guess I just did it the hard way. Just pick mushroom blocks and throw them right at them while avoiding the fireballs. Okay, I could not done this without save states, so Yeah. I approach this boss way any way you want. I guess the, the shields, the mushroom block shield strategy is the best, but clearly they do that. So, ah oh well. I think that's well six done. I just stand there, apparently. There we go. Now we have one more world where to go. World seven. Because there's no world eight, apparently. So, yeah. And we all got two more levels left to go. Why not the loser free? I don't know why. You just don't believe me? Look. There's only two squares, meaning only two levels. So, let's do the penultimate level now. We're back out in the skies now. And we got tons of bombs here. And in jetties. So, yeah. We've got a power block here. Which can be very helpful. Be gone! Four days, but I still got loud enough just kids outside. I can't help it. It's summer. It's really hard outside. Never. But you can just want to play outside and yell and scream. And. Yes, as you can tell, I hate kids. <laughs> okay. So. In here, we actually got some sort of hidden bonus one here. So no, let's go back in. Ow! There we go. Let's see, nope, nope, nope. Here he is. So pick up this and we can get ourselves another mushroom and some more coins. Yay! But if it, this is the bonus room, then where are we supposed to go? We kinda hit a dead end. 
Well, not really. Uh, see here. See this albatross? Yeah, we're supposed to wide it. Yes. We gotta wide this albatross all the way back to the beginning of the level. Why we do this? Well, you see why. To jump over this pillar. Again, very cryptic. I don't know how you would know it unless I don't know, use Nintendo Power or just think, hmm, I think I'll wide the albatross today. I don't know. Yeah, we jump over here and walk it! Okay, and now we got some snails to deal with. No, thank you. And now he had this this sort of neat puzzle here. Again, if you jump here, you'll jump back up, back up to the top of the platform here. So you want to get yourself all the way down here, unless there's a star in here, in which case, yes, please grab it. So basically you just want to run all the way down to the bone here without jumping back up or getting hit by the enemy. And yeah, like that, I gotta go back down again. So yeah, so that's, so that's how you want to push that. Okay, get with you. And... Oh! If you're in ASA state, yeah, don't do that. Jump up here instead and climb up this ladder. And now we gotta jump high into the clouds now, avoiding a bunch of sparkies. Uh. This is the first annoying one to deal with. Ow! Let's try that again. So what I do is avoid sparkies and what's bad sparkies, one of the sparkies at least is in there, then do that and then yeah they'll just run towards the bar now they won't go at the top so that's very helpful so I can climb, climb up until we reach the top now check over the store and here we have a penultimate bird over here so there's another grey one which again only shoots fireballs ow uh, personal space. Ow. And there we go. Pick it up. There we go. Here, have a mushroom block. Oh, I can't go through with it. Fine. You can have it. Hey. Cut out. Cut the slot machine now, guys. It just took forever. But anyways, now we'll find the last level of the game. Well, seven two. Figure me nothing. Let's do it with Mario. So yeah, here we are. We're at the evil villain's fortress. Like I said, it's not Bowser. Well, for some reason. You know, every other time it's Bowser. So, however, uh, so so. Okay, but still, why is it not there? Uh, whatever. Get with his snippets. Let's head into his castle and convey about. Oh no. So get through this. Deal with the shy guys first. No. No. Jump. And now we've got to deal with the ninjetties. There we go. And after that, we got the bombs. Then Pansy is. No, Uncle Cut. And now to climb up this chain. And here's some Sparkies to deal with. Go. Hmm, there's a door behind that wall. Wonder how we get to it. More Sparkies to deal with. Ow. Too late now, I wait took in damage. Uh bad say say to do. Especially when at the end of the level. Now you can go through the story you want, 
always just keep climbing up. If you decide to go through this door, it will take you back outside the fortress. And it will take you back all the way down. Down to a ladder below here, as you can see here. I know, like an idiot, I so kill myself. Now, I don't want least down there. It was a trap or just another way to get through the level. But I will do it. I'll just keep climbing up. Ow! So, I guess one way you can go through it, but I think I'll take the other way. Uh, jump! Okay. So, we'll just keep going. And. Oh, Sparkies, Sparkies, Sparkies. Just need some very precise jumps. Not like that. There we go. Got some more Sparkies to do. No! Duck! There we go. Okay, now we should do this. Jump! Come on! And jump! 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 No! Oh. There you go! Make some very quick jumps. Oh. Why did I jump then? I don't know why. Just hope that the input delay is, is your friend. Right, there we go. Oh, this is a power box to get rid of Sparkies. Now we're on the road to the final boss. Or to say, Gabay about. More spikers there. Ah! Duck. Okay. Duck. Duck. Yeah, I think there's three spikers that will approach you. Now we go down here. Here we have a final birder, which is actually holding a key that we need. So, yeah, we gotta deal with this birder here. Okay, shoots both fireballs and eggs. So, by this point, you know what to do. The only annoying thing is you got to do it on like a conveyor belt, which just constantly pushes you back. Ow! Again, sorry for. Sorry for the outside world being so annoying. But don't worry, we're nearly done. Got the X, thank you. Damn it! Yeah, this is a very annoying birdo to deal with. But there you go. Save this. Let's go through the store. And yeah, as you do that, as you throw the key and enter the door, you will lose the key as if. Fire gets burned all over again, so don't do that! So pick this key, avoid the spark keys, like that. And go through this door. Um, and go in and out again, clearly, yes. And here we have an to pick up. Let's go for this last hawk gate, I guess. Oh, what, what? It's attacking us! Oh god! So, yeah, we actually gotta fight against the gate that we've been going through itself. That's a bit creepy and terrifying, but. But it's really no different from a Birdo fight, really. Except that the Birdo is now flying everywhere and just not firing anything. Which is helpful. So it says... I think, it, I think it takes like three or four hits to take care of. Then we'll decide to open it and go in it. And now... We're at the final boss, ladies and gentlemen. And who is it? Well, it's not Bowser. Well, well, say hello to what? Who only appears in this one game. Which is a shame, because I would like to see him appear in future Mario games, unfortunately, but oh well. He will constantly fire bubbles at you for some reason, which do indeed hurt you. And what you want to do is, 
You see this thing? Well, it will shoot up vegetables at it and just press to throw vegetables in his mouth. So basically, throw the vegetables once he starts firing bubbles at you. Because for some reason, this, he hates vegetables, which I understand, so... Basically, just keep throwing vegetables into his mouth until he dies. Now, why he has a vegetable they can shoot in his own room is beyond me, but... Ugh. Whatever that. Sorry, that wasn't a fun before. So yeah, this is the final boss. Pretty simple. Yeah, I'll say it's slightly harder than the Bowser fights we're doing in the first Mario game, but not by much. Just throw vegetables to his mouth, and there you go, he's way down. And ladies and gentlemen, Super Mario Bros. 2 is complete. Let's free the Subconians. Yay, we're free! Thank you, Mario! And we play as Mario six times, play as Luigi six times, play as Princess Peach five times, and play as Toad three times. <laughs> I'm sorry if I didn't play as Toad that much, but I guess I just wasn't a fan of his jump. I mean, this is a Mario game, jumping is number one priority, so that's why Mario and Luigi are. Well, they both contributors, so. Yeah, what is done? Done, we'll never see war ever again, unfortunately. And the whole game was just a dream. Or was it? Hmm. Yeah. Okay, well this is an odd ending. Was the whole thing was just a dream? Was this whole thing was just a lie? Or was my just dream about the industry just had like they dream about it? Oh well, either way, we finished the game. Here we have, well, not really the credits, but sort of a roll call here. So of course, we got My Luigi, Princess Toad, Shy Guy, Sniffit, Ninji, Biso, Porcupo, I thought that was Sonic, Tweeter, the bomb Hoopstar I was Hoopster Trout Trouter Pidget Pansier Is that the name of Pokemon 2? I don't know. Fluffy Albatoss you mean Trosh Phanto Spark not Sparky or whatever Subcon Yep Pokey Bird what what? That's not Birdo. Astro, what? Yeah, there are actually cause some clear errors in this East Quit, so they're not Hymson White. So there's Kowat, Ma Mouse Air, Fly Guy, Claw G Glip. You mean Grip. Try Clyde, you mean Try Oh god. And of course what? Who will never appear in my series ever again. Which is an absolute shame. We never see war again, so I've seen Bowser again and 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 again. You get a point. So there you go, the end. There you go, that's Super Mario Bros. 2 done. Overall, yeah, I say this game's much better than Lost Levels, obviously, but I think it's better than Super Mario Bros. 1, honestly. I think the controls were better, the level sign was more fairer. She had no power ups in this game, I think about it, except for the star man, but still. So, yeah, I thought the level sign was just better in general. So yeah, I like this game better. Next Mario game I will be doing, aside from Donkey Kong Mario Bros, which I yet to do all enough, it will be Super Mario Bros 3, so that will be interesting to do. <laughs> So it's one and who I hope you enjoy this let's play and I'll see you next time. See you later people.